Hello! In this tutorial, I'll show you how to isolate vocals on soundtrack. The first thing you like to do is to open your web browser and go to the Soundtrap web app. In the website, log into your account using your account credentials if prompted. And that's going to walk you into the home page. From the home page, navigate to the project section in the middle of the screen. Then open an existing project by clicking on the studio button right next to it or click on enter studio to open a new project so i'm going to click on studio on an existing project and the studio interface will load as this is loading the next step is to import or record a track with the vocals if you have an audio file with vocals you want to isolate go ahead and click on add new track which is right here in the middle of of the studio or and it's also at the left corner of the studio so once you click on that go ahead and add a new track or just select import file to import a new track now if you need to record vocals just click on add new track and click on voice and mic and something like this is going to show up where you have the mic for your vocals and this one is just the imported track so click on the track that contains the vocals to highlight it. So let's say this is the track that contains the vocals, right? The next thing to do is to click on edit. And once you click on edit, it takes you here, click on effect, and that's going to open up the effects panel. Then the menu of um, audio effects will appear. So these are the audio effects. We have theater, we have visual IQ, EQ, we have just remove. We have vocal preamp, we have reverb, we have equalizer, and just a couple. So, to isolate the vocals, you can use the EQ to filter at certain frequencies. Select EQ effects on the effects menu. If you don't find EQ, I have my EQ here equalizer, just go ahead and click on add effect. I want to click on add effect, search for EQ, that's the equalizer, and drag and drop. So, I have my EQ here. In the EQ settings, Cut the low frequencies below 100 Hz. All right, so cut it below. So you have to reduce this. You have to leave, reduce the slider and make it below 100 Hz as low as possible. Then the high frequencies should be above 8. The high frequency should be above 8 khc to focus on the mid range where most vocals sit now this will help highlight the vocals and reduce other elements also you can use a vocal remover which is optional if you want to isolate vocals for purposes like karaoke or remixing soundtrap offers some built-in tools that can attempt to reduce other instruments or background sound so select vocal remover if available from the effects menu to try isolating the vocals. Let's see if that is available. Vocal remover. Oh, that's not available. If it's available, then that's pretty much going to help. So, once you're done, especially with the equalizer settings, since we don't have the vocal remover option there, go ahead and press play, which is at the bottom of the studio to listen to the track with the applied effects. You can now fine tune the EQ or the vocal remover. That's if you find it, if you import it anywhere, by adjusting the sliders until you achieve the desired vocal isolation. So, also, you can duplicate and isolate vocals, which is optional. If you want to isolate vocals from an existing mix, one common technique is to duplicate the track and reverse the polarity of one of the tracks. And this method works best when the vocals are panned centrally and it helps cancel out the background music. So you're going to have to right click the track, let's say this is the track, click on the three dots menu. Okay, right click the track and click on duplicate. So once you duplicate the track, it's going to be duplicated, then select one of the tracks and click effects. So let's say this is duplicated now and let's say this is the track. So select one of the track and highlight it. Edit, effect, and add effect. Let's search for 
invert polarity oh invert polarity is also not available on soundtrack also let's see if phase inversion okay or oh, phaser should also work so if you can just add this now the vocal will remain once you add this the vocal will remain while other instrumental elements cancel out yes so the phaser will help with that so once you satisfy with the isolation vocals just of course how to add the phaser just drag and drop once you satisfy with the isolated vocals click export button in the top right corner of the screen choose the desired file format and download the file so go over to Tara from the top to the bottom to get acquainted with the steps and once you're done you'll be good to go hope this tutorial marvelously helped your search